Hello and welcome to my Scratch mini guide series. Today we are going to be looking at how we can move our sprite, whether it's uh, the cat or anything. So let's jump right into it if I uh, do this. So we can see I've got uh, my Scratch open here. I'm just gonna zoom in a little bit just to make it nice and easy for you to see. Now what I'm only interested in is moving my cat with the arrow keys. So I want whenever I press my arrow keys for it to move. And to do this, all I need to do is I need to go down to my events on the left here and I'm gonna grab a when some kind of key press. Now this space has a drop down menu, so it's not always space, we can change this to whatever. So we're gonna move this over here and I'm gonna say whenever the left arrow key is pressed, I'm gonna do something and I'm also gonna grab another one and I'm gonna do one for the right arrow as well. So when left, when right, what are we gonna do? Well, we are going to move a certain amount of steps. Now if I do that and that and hit play, Bob's my uncle, it moves, but if I press E the key, it always moves right. So now what I need to do is just make sure that the direction is specified. So we're moving 10 steps, yes, but we are constantly pointing in direction of 90, which needs to be changed. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna come into motion still, uh, and I'm gonna have a point in direction. And so point in direction there, point in direction there. It's important that you do this before you move, so I need to point and then move, rather than moving and then pointing, okay? Now when I'm gonna point, left when I press the left arrow, so minus 90, and I'm gonna point 90, which is right, when I'm pressed the right arrow. So now I should be able to hit the green flag and I can walk around, and you can see that Scratch has turned upside down, but I can walk left and right. Now to stop him turning upside down, we need to just change how he behaves, and I believe in this version of Scratch we should be able to do it here we go, uh, in motion still, the set rotation style. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pop this on a green flag. You can obviously put this in your um, code wherever you want it to go. But I'm gonna say when green flag clicked, to set rotation style to left, right, okay? And this means that he won't turn upside down, he'll just turn left and right, he'll just flip. So there we go. Now I've got him moving left, I've got him moving right. And that is the end of number one, uh, or scratch mini guide number one. Thank you for watching. Um, and I'll see you in the next one.